So we've been planning our uh, Memorial Day canoe trip this year. Um, be a four-day trip. Uh, Colin, myself, and our friend Chris. Uh, this will actually be Colin's longest trip to date. He's done several overnight trips with me, uh, but this will be his his first um, trip over two days. Um, so what we have here is we've got um, our bear canister. Uh, I'm going to be taking this um, not so much for the bears, uh, although there are black bears in Missouri. Uh, just a, an easy way to store the food and really uh, helps keep animals like raccoons and, and other animals away from your food. Uh, I've got a small cooler back there. I wasn't originally going to bring a cooler on this trip, um, but I, at the last minute I kind of thought, well, it, it would be good to uh, take some, some fresh milk. Um, and something to put the eggs in. Now, I've had bad luck in the past with the milk spoiling um, it, on the first night. Uh, of course, that's usually in July or August when it's really hot, so hopefully this one won't be as bad. Um, and then the eggs themselves, I've actually uh, oiled those to help preserve them a little bit longer as well. So we have uh, lunches here for me and Colin. Chris will be bringing his own snacks for lunch. Uh, so this is uh, Cliff Bars. We've got granola bars, drink mixes, fruit snacks. This one has some dried fruit in it. Um, the other two days, we've got uh, some gorp here in its place. Uh, breakfast, like I mentioned, we'd be having eggs. Um, I don't have those out there in the fridge, along with some uh, shredded cheese. And I like to put a little milk in the eggs to make them more fluffy. If our milk does spoil, I've got some powdered milk here for those as well. Uh, the other two days for breakfast, we'll be having um, oatmeal. So we've got two packets apiece, along with some brown sugar in order to sweeten that up a little bit. And I've got some electrolyte tablets, just if it does get hot, those kind of help you feel a little bit better when you really start sweating. Uh, one dinner will be uh, macaroni and cheese. This is uh, Colin's favorite dinner while we're camping. Um, I've got two packets, and then I've got some uh, powdered milk here, and we'll be using ghee, which is clarified butter, uh, in lieu of regular butter. Uh, clarified butter simply has the fat removed so it doesn't spoil as quickly. Uh, pretty much tastes the same when you're cooking with it though. Uh, another night we're going to be having spaghetti. I've got a pound of hamburger here. We've got uh, noodles and sauce and tomato paste to make the sauce. And then the third night we have uh, sloppy joes. We've got some hamburger buns, some seasoning mix, pound of hamburger again. Um, and then we have dessert. We've got s'mores for one night. We've got a uh, fruit roll-up which is just dried applesauce. Uh, you can also reconstitute this into a uh, applesauce, and we have a instant pudding as well um, that has the uh, powdered milk already mixed in. And then Colin likes to have a glass of milk before bed, so if, if the milk does go bad, I've got some more powdered milk here as well. And that's what you need for uh, four people or three people for a four-day trip.